Whoa, hold on. Drop that on my head. That didn't even go to fucking. Oh. Um, anyways. Wait, does he know what that? Does he know what that word means? Oh no! Wait, this was the cool NFL guy, wasn't it? Oh no! Or N NBA, not NFL. Sorry. Um. Holy yikes! Wait, he must know what he's saying, right? Wait, do you think he's gonna like... Oh man, do you think this guy's career is over? Like, I only have um... one thing to say, Woo well, yeah. He just... Cowards don't f***ing me, you f***ing... <laughs> he just like, hard drops it. What is he, what is he doing? Like... Is... Maybe he doesn't... I'm gonna have to- I, he must not know what it means. I- I can't imagine. I, he doesn't even seem that mad. Like, it's not like he's like screaming and it came out in like a tirade or some shit, right? I'm so confused right now. Why would- explain the word- I, it's an anti-semitic slur. I doubt he would say it and not know what it is. I'm just trying to figure because like... So if he was like in a scream, I'm just like, Ah, oh, you mother- and then he like said it or whatever. Then I could. Then I'm like, oh yeah, this guy fucked up hard. But he's like pretty calm here. He doesn't seem like he's like super mad, and he just drops it. I can't. There's no. There's no way. Right? Like how? How? Why would he say the word though? Where would he have heard it? I'm just trying to like. He must. He must know. That he's like ending his career by doing this. Grab it, I gotta take a quick phone call. Yep. Yo, my wife needs me. She just called me. I'll, uh, I gotta roll, brother. GG's. Okay. Hey, did you about that? What do you think? Yep. Bye bye. I, dude, I'm so confused. I wouldn't be surprised at all if he just forgot he was streaming. Oh, maybe. Maybe he just like isn't thinking much about it. it does he have a thousand subs though down here? It looks like he. I, I dude, I can't, I can't even. My brain is just. Why can't we just attribute this to him not knowing what it means? Well, so like that. My my first thought was like he just must not know what this word means, but like. How, where do you hear that word as an insult and not understand that it's anti-Semitic? Like, how, where, who, where, in what communities are people just randomly? Oh shit! I, I have, dude. I don't know. That's just crazy to me. I just can't imagine. I just can't. Cod lobbies. I thought cod people just use the N word. Maybe they, maybe they do use the K word too. I thought it was anti-Irish. Apparently a lot of people in chat don't know what that means either. I learned that word on 4chan without knowing what it means. Do we really care though if the meaning wasn't anti-Semitic? I mean, I, I, per, I think it's important. I, that's not gonna matter, of course, to the public eye. I'm more, I'm just curious, like, I'm more just curious, like, what happened? It, uh, um... Jesus. Yeah, I don't know, man. Holy jeez. Finally, just forgetting he was streaming for a moment and slipped out. Yeah, I wonder. That might, that, I guess, I think that makes the most sense. Yeah. He must have just, like, not been aware that he was, like, streaming, I guess. Maybe? But he, I don't know. It looks like, from the sub count, it looks like he streams pretty often. Jeez. I think he might have heard it from his NBA teammates. NBA play yeah, that's what I was starting to wonder. But, yeah. Well, damn. How crazy. Do you forget that you're streaming from time to time? Not really, but I've been streaming for like 11 years. But my, my real life vocabulary has moved like pretty similarly to my stream vocabulary. So it's not like, like if a conversation of mine got leaked, like a private combo, it's not like I'm just like saying like the F sir and hard R is like, <laughs> it's just, there's just not normal words in my vocabulary anymore. Oh, Dan, Who is we need your opinion. Uh-huh. 
Here comes a shitty joke, but it's go not for a it. joke. We need to get your opinion on what an NBA player said today. Somebody link him the clip. Uh huh. You think I know something about sports for some reason? It's not about sports, Dan. We need your raw, unfiltered reaction to something. Okay, give me the link. I'll click it. Look, look, Myers look. Leonard guide. I still don't. He was have... scuffed. Okay. Yeah. We're and S. Kamado, 42, with the first... No, god damn it. That was the wrong fucking link. God damn it. Oh, C-Bay, 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 C-Bay. <sighs> All right, hold on. Let me watch this. Wait. This guy sounds like he's going to say the N-word. I can I can feel it. I know the feeling. All right, I'm going to watch it. I, admit, I type on. Good job. You survived, my dude. Whoa! Yeah. This guy's been playing in a lot of the fucking uh, southern lobbies, I think. He must be uh, down in the Georgia area. Okay, so I'm watching this video, gay. Do you think he? Do you think he doesn't know what that word means? Because oh, of he like you know what it is. He pauses before he says it, and then he just like does it. But I mean, he's got like a thousand subs. Listen, like he streams pretty regularly. Do you think he know, or do you think he thought it was just like a general insult? I find no. it so hard to believe that he would just fucking let it fly like that. He absolutely thought it was a general. No, listen. This is what, this is what games do to you. Okay, I myself have had an okay, experience I like understand. this in the past. No, no, I understand what you say. Okay, for I've literally had an experience like this. Probably got thirty day ban for it. Okay, so I understand. Okay, what this is. Okay, when when you have it, when you have a an intense gamer moment. However. He doesn't it look like he's, he's not like particularly mad. He doesn't seem like he's like super like set off or like super ass mad or anything. Yeah, but apparently um, I'm reading this now. This is a dude who like said you should like he's the only dude standing for. Oh, my God. Dan is just going all into the propaganda. Holy shit. It works, guys. I told you how I try to explain this is the raw emotion I feel in my heart during that anthem, looking at that flag, remembering my my brother every time he was overseas when I would play my senior year of high school and on, on through the time he he served uh, when I was in my second year at University of Illinois, that raw emotion and pain and love that I feel in my heart is the same thing based upon real life experience that a lot of my former teammates, current teammates, and people all around the league and all around the world who are African-American feel in their heart because they have seen it. They have felt it. They're talking to teammates like, well, if I get in my car today, I might not, I might not come home based upon the color of my skin. I might get pulled over based upon the color of my skin. Like, for example, uh, CJ McCollum, he wouldn't mind if I mentioned his name. He told me one morning, bro, I got pulled over last night doing 36 under 35. Can you believe that shit? Like what? He was with his white girlfriend coming home from from dinner in a nice car because he's black. They pulled him over. I have no. I, that's never going to happen to me. I know that I have white privilege. It is a very fucking real thing. And if you don't think it's real, you're fucking wrong. Just because I stand, that's the love in my heart. My brother served. I have many friends who served and have given. I mean, it's very complex. However, I can be both. It's not like people will say who don't know and that are ignorant, they say, yeah, black lives matter, but all lives matter. No, no, you're missing the point. Right now we have to focus and help this community and culture, period. So I, I can support the military, stand for the anthem and not, but, and yes. be with the black lives matter movement. That is yes. fine. I have seen this for so many years. I sat with seven different guys, all black at the same, at the same time and talked with them because I trusted them and I wanted to know what they thought, would they feel disrespected? I want to come to you, give me the truth, tell me what you think people are going to think of me, tell you what tell me what you're going to think of me, tell the league's going to think of me, everything. Uh I mean, I was shaking like this was hard uh, because to my core, I know who I am, I know I'm a good man, I know I have a good heart. Period. There's no there, there's no dispute about that. And the main point I got from it was they said Myers, anybody who knows you is not going to have an issue with it. Uh, cause they know your heart, they know your intentions and they know that you, what you're expressing to us is that you should be able to be both. And I'll touch on that in a second. But, um, but the fact that perception is reality, right? That is true. He did do that. I said it was a really bad look for him. So people are going to like tie these together. Yeah. Well, well, then he's fucked. He's literally fucked. Congratulations. You played yourself by standing idiot. He's done. Well, there goes his, 
I mean, he lost probably. a gaming sponsorship. I wonder if he'll get kicked out of the NBA. Mr. Moon's like, nah, no way. No shot. No Mr. shot. No shot. But damn, dude, I don't know. How, is there like precedence for like NBA players just like dropping slurs like that? Does anybody the, know? The real, do you know what it comes down to? What? How good does he is? This make it, does this make it off of Twitter at all right now? Well, yeah, he's already mainstream. lost a gaming sponsorship over it, so it's probably yeah, going to start. The fuck that, but is it going to make it to mainstream news? Is it going to be on CNN tonight that an NFL player said that? If I, not... Maybe well, he's fine. when that one was it a Formula One driver said the N word on stream? Yeah, yeah, but that, but, on yeah. yeah, but that people don't care about us, Stephen. We're not as cool anymore. Remember, like lefties don't care about us, righties don't care about us. We're just a forgotten race about people, America. Oh, Jews. Yeah. Wait, exactly. why are you saying? Uh, hold on, wait. Okay, people already call me Jewish. Please don't refer to Jews as us when you're talking to me. Okay, I don't need that association right now, Dan. Oh, okay. Yeah, I people. Think that you're Jewish, Stephen? Yeah, oh, I yeah. thought he was too. <laughs> well, yeah. well, you're not really. When all when I used to debate a lot of Nazis, at some point rumors started that I was Jewish. I I don't know why, but hey, every time I see anyone get into an argument with Nazis, they're, they're like, "Are you Jewish? Are you Jewish?" Like as if that's the only reason why. You're yeah, Jewish. why you might not want to like them. exterminate a whole race of people. Yeah. <laughs> If the guy who touched every microphone and caused the NBA to shut down over Corona, it didn't get fucking ejected from the NBA, he's not gonna fucking. Dude, do you have any idea how hard it was to not joke about that on that fucking podcast with him? <laughs> <laughs> Train sent me like thirty minutes. He's like, "Stupid, yeah. please don't say anything stupid. Don't do it. Don't." Do it. I'm like, <laughs> "Is there something wrong with people thinking you are Jewish, Stephen? Feels weird, man." I don't want to get credit for being Jewish if I'm not Jewish. NBA spokesman Mike Bast, Bast or Mike Bass, statement on Myers Leonard, who said an anti-Semitic song in a video game. We just became aware of the video and are in the press of gathering more information. The NBA unequivocally condemns all forms of hate speech. Nice. Just such a brand, like, you don't hear people say that word in COD either. I know, know that, well, they might. That's why, that's why I'm wondering, I'm wondering if he... No, that's next level. If you're hearing that, that means you're like... I don't think he knows what it of... means. I don't think he knows what it means. I don't. I truly you don't say it. You wouldn't say it. You, that doesn't make sense. I Give remember. A, I know that I know as a kid. I know that I know. as a kid, when you're just like screaming at people like Xbox Live, I know that I hear people say something like that. Just goes into like UK motherfucker piece of shit. Blah blah. blah. Like, I don't know. If, I don't know if I knew what the fuck it was when I was like 13 or 14, like playing on fucking X by arcade or whatever. Like that's um, definitely true. Yeah, you, it's, that's, that's just like a random like fucking word. Sports. I don't know if yeah. But this guy's I mean, like... I'm not defending this guy necessarily, but mm -hmm. it is true that people say shit without knowing really what it means. Yeah. But th yeah, this guy's older though. But I, that's not really... Honest to God, I don't know if you normally hear the K word ever. Like, would you hear that word? That you'd yeah, be like, oh yeah, I know that word. That's like an anti semitic With Nazis. <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> that is true. Yeah. Do you know where the origination of that word came from? Nope. Nope. Educate us, Dan. So I believe it was way back in the day when Jews were emigrating uh, to America and landing on Ellis Island, and they were asking uh, the Jews to do their signature. But a lot of Jews didn't actually have last names back in the day, believe it or not. It was mostly like Dan, son of David, or Moishi, son mm -hmm. of, you know, whatever. That's how it was. So um, what they were doing is they were drawing a circle. And the I believe it's the Yiddish word for circle is keikel. Um, that's how you say it. So that's, I believe, how it got started. That's interesting. Really, Dan? I believe so. I'm sure lots of offensive words like uh, have mundane origins. Hey, you dumb fox. What? We can be mean to Dan, but if you're gonna be fucking rude to Dan, I'm gonna fucking ban you if you're a white name. All right, cool it down. Why are you only banning the white names? Yeah, if you want to, if you yeah, want to, we're really gonna ban them Dan. All. Like, lawful I'll get them all. In chat are it's usually white ones. names who are the rude ones. Why right? We have a relationship happy. with Dan. We can be mean to him. Also, I have feelings. Okay. Wow. Yeah. What do you mean? Well, yes, so I have feelings. Calm down, DGG. When people in there say Dan sucks, I hate Dan. I wish Dan would no longer be here. I read that. It makes me sad. Dan, if you like your restaurants better, you just say it. You don't have to like beat around the bush. It's not that I like them better. It's just a different experience, right? Like, so you know how you like to have a lot of different partners in your relationships? <laughs> well, it's kind of like that. You know, I mean, I, you guys are, of course, very important to me, but Dan, I have other people who are really weird. also very important to me as well. 
and it's a different experience. And you're you know making I mean? Steve feel weird, man. Well, I'm trying to put it to him in a way that he can understand here. What do you mean in a way that he can understand? What? Like my, well, you're very, his brain just can't. Yeah, yeah. He, he's a very yeah, yeah. small, small minded. I mean, he comes from a line of people that, you know, quite oh. frankly, had to like enslave people. As you know, those are your heritage, right, Stephen? So, you know, those are not big brained people. And um, I'm just breaking it down for you nice and, and easily. You're Cuban. I don't know. Be careful, Dan. Yeah, sorry, keep going, Dan. No, yeah. keep going. No, I like this. No, no, I no. Like no, no. I'm sorry. I don't know how far I can keep going with the meme. <laughs> Let's see your true colors, Dan. No, no. I'm sorry. I was trying to be a lefty for a second, but it's it's too dangerous. I don't think I can do it. This is not it, Dan. Alrighty. So, um, <clears throat> what were we talking about now? Something about my Cuban brain. So that that whole thing, the the G word. Can we say the G word or no? Or like, I don't even know. Like, I guess it's sanctioned by right, Twitch, what's right? What's the G the word again? That, um, I believe it's LinkedIn chat in a few spots. He's talking about Gusano. Oh, yes, oh. that word. Whoa. Yeah. Not that I would ever say I that. I mean, people like, dude, I've seen some crazy shit being said about me. If I was a more sensitive person, okay, I would be crying. These people will load up their stream and like, Destiny, that blue-eyed Gusano fuck. And I'm like, oh my God, wait, this guy's insane. And they don't get in any trouble for it. That seems like pretty fucking crazy. Hold on, give me 22 seconds. I'm just curious what this is. Up arms because I call Destiny a fucking Gusano. Because he is. Oh, but he's Cuban. This motherfucker has blue eyes. Not that it necessarily matters, but I can definitely tell you that because of the because I can definitely tell you that his family owned fucking a plantation. His family definitely owned fucking slaves. It's also just incredibly hypocritical. I just don't understand. Like, if their goal is to discredit you, this seems like the worst way to go about it. It's just not very smart at all. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know why they're not getting in trouble either. I contacted my partner manager about it. And there was a huge LSF thread about it. And I reported the channel, but nothing happened. I don't know. Hmm. Yeah, it's strange. Strange. Curious. One you might should say. make a point of going after it, though, Stephen. Should I go what? You should try and, you know, make a point of doing as much I as I do. You Every time somebody says it to me, yeah. like, it blows up on LSF and shit, and then people report the channel, but nothing happens. I just, Twitch just doesn't nothing give a fuck. Yeah. If I had a partner manager, I'd reach out to him for you, but I don't. My partner manager didn't like me at all. He didn't give a fuck about me. Who was it? Well, oh, fuck. I mean, it doesn't matter anymore. Wait, real, real talk. What are the odds you think you become a partner again? I know, like, you don't, you maybe, you don't want to say right now because you think it affects you. I don't, be real. I think that... It's very, very, very low because if I was to become a partner again, I'd try to negotiate a non-exclusive contract. Because I, because like when drama and stuff is blowing up, like I get like a good amount of viewers on YouTube, and I don't know if I'd want to throw that away now. Yeah, but then, well, and you know the thing is, once Twitch Prime goes away, which it probably will, then there's really that drive to be a partner doesn't really matter as much. That anymore, shit's right? never going away, Dan. You're wrong. I think it's gone this year. No, nope. really? Yeah, I, I'm going to tell you how it's going to happen too. Twitch is going to launch another Prime. That's separate from Amazon Prime, guaranteed. Nope, no drop. You're you're wrong. You're delusional. You want to bet? Yeah, hundred bucks. You want to bet? Hundred bucks. Yeah. Hundred bucks. I well, let, okay, let's really fine tune what okay. we're talking about here. Okay. So Which will I get rid of the function that allows you to give a streamer a subscription and give them money um, okay. for for quote unquote free or by buying an Amazon product? That's Okay, I want. I want to. So I want to. I want to fine tune that. Mm -hmm. What I want to say is that I believe within this year that Twitch will no longer allow you to directly or indirectly give money to another streamer simply by virtue of you having an Amazon Prime subscription. Sure. Now there might be an additional plan that they add of Amazon Pl Prime Plus Plus or Twitch Prime nope, Gaming. I don't need that. I take that, Dan. Okay, then yeah, I think you're delusional. Um, okay. Hundred bucks. I, and I, I guarantee what they're going to try and do as well is they're going to try and give you some sort of um, additional benefit on the site to to get it. So you pay ten dollars a month for ad free. Because I do believe another thing that's coming is that they're going to make they'll probably disable embeds completely. And I think that. Um, they'll find a way to make it so that ads cannot be blocked at all anymore. Oh, they've been trying that over and over and over again. It seems a little bit harder I, it, than... I don't think it should be hard. Like, technically... It's pretty that, hard. Well, I no. Think. Like, technically, like, it should not be hard in the slightest. 
Um, Wait, can you explain why you believe that? Well, sure. So they need to stop sending video. The, the best that you as a client can do is potentially should be able to look at a black screen and wait 60 seconds in silence. Yeah, but it feels that like the problem do. is that because ads are filled locally, you can't just do international, like universal ad sales. Any hook that goes to check for a locality, it seems like if you could block that, it feels like that's what people are doing in order to avoid the ads, no? Wasn't, isn't that like the big well, way well, of I mean, how the, the ad block works? Uh, well, that's how you get higher paying ads. Okay. No, so I don't know instance, if there's any universal ads because look at think of link language. Well, listen, you you have an IP address for someone, and you can really base a lot off of that. And you, there's no way you're blocking the fact that you're, you know, in Miami and watching this, and your language is English or your language is Spanish. Like that alone is enough to get very specific targeting. Enough to go. Um, now, if you get more data, like you know, Facebook information or whatever uh, cookie shit that they have from Amazon, sure, you can get more targeted and have higher paying ads, but I, I, you can still, you know, you're still talking over $4 CPM for video ads just off of an IP address and, mm -hmm. and knowing the person's language. I, I believe that for sure. Um, but yeah, I, I mean, I, I believe that Twitch Prime is over this year for sure. I just don't see why it would keep coming. Even if it's not a lot of money, I don't think they want to Actually, I'm curious how much money they do give out. Um, I wonder if that's disclosed anywhere. Oh, wait, you kind of... Well, how much that. Amazon give to Twitch Primes? Yeah, exactly. Uh, every, every year or something. Well, I don't know. How much do you think... Um, how much do you think the payouts from Twitch are in general, right? Like, even the top guys make what? Well, what is it? Okay, if you imagine the top... 1% makes 90% of the revenue. Is that what we're going off of? Is that the case? The top 1% makes 90% of the revenue on the platform usually? Uh, I'm not sure, but that sounds about right, doesn't it? Steven would probably know better. Top 1% make 90% of the revenue? It's probably more than that, yeah. But yeah, top 1% probably make like 95 or 98% of the revenue. Hmm. Maybe it's not that much on subscriptions then to matter. It's really hard to say. No, oh, we'll know on December. No, oh, sorry. Well, no, on January 1st when I come to collect, Dan. Oh, yeah. Wait, so do, you have a, do you have an official statement on Myers Leonard? Did you see that shit? I did. I did. What the fuck? I saw it, I saw it briefly. Yeah, I don't know. He had no idea what the word meant. That's I, what I, I, I legitimately yeah. think he didn't. But, like, I have God to assume damn. he didn't know what the word meant because, like, if you're going to, like, pause and think about, like, right? Yeah. That, that, that is not the word you choose. I know, that's yeah. That's you say without thinking. Jesus. If you're like, no, well, that's not something you say without thinking. That's something you say, like, if you're into, right? If, yeah, if you had to pause. Without thinking. Like, he, there's no way he had an idea of what the word meant. There's no way he knew. Like, instantly, I thought, like, what I thought about in that second was he was hanging out with people that said it. And maybe he, I don't know, like, they either... Reaction or something, yeah. Yeah, like, it seemed like maybe, like, he was around someone that said it, and, like, either, like, you know, he just didn't know what it meant. What about, or, like, but if you're, if you're hanging around with people that are saying that a lot, is that a problem, or is it not a problem? Yeah, it probably is, but if you don't know what it means and you don't think know it's a problem, then, right, like, so right, right now, like, I assumed that whoever he was with that said that, he's probably fucking pissed at. Because yeah, they quite downplayed maybe. what it meant. I don't know. It just didn't seem like you knew what that word means. There's no way, like, out of all the words you pause and think about, you use that one. Like, that's... Yeah. Especially you know? with Twitch streaming. He literally paused. Yeah, there's just no possible way. He's in a shitty situation, but yeah, it's... No, no way. It's too bad he couldn't redact.dev that mm -hmm. comment. Am I right, Mr. Moon? Remember to hit that like and subscribe and don't forget the notification bell so that my videos show up right in your feed. No, no, I think that's our major seven. Uh...